Hello, everyone. Have some phase mid. I haven't seen a phase since the, like, third round of nerf she got after those couple of patches ago. So, I'm just curious to see if she's still viable. I don't really know what people build on her. But, uh, I know that Bell stacks pretty well with her E. So, I think I'm gonna rush Bell's here. Okay. Yeah, not bad. She missed both of her bombs, so she does still have two blinks. Richter. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Just gonna annoy him a little bit. I know he'll be right back. So I'm not gonna go in on the Bellica right now until I until he shows dual lane. Never mind. Only because it's free. Nice. Should be dead. Uh, but yeah, she just keeps walking into my face, and that's pretty much the exact opposite of what you want to do to a phase. Even though the link only lasts six seconds now, it's still plenty of time to get some damage in. And you almost always win the auto attack trade if you have link up. I don't know what people take second. I don't even know what people max on this character. I didn't play her when she was uh, not nerfed. I gotta get better at that. Yeah, that was good. Ugh, this is getting scary. Was she spotted somehow? Okay. Uh, yeah, no idea what people max. I think Q would make sense. But so with Link. Wow, you just missed everything. Oh, it still didn't matter. That's that's rough. Maybe I should have done Q instead of right click. Ugh. And I I held the Q for a while there because I wanted to get in range to get the double damage on it. But I'm not even sure if I got that. Duo lane's winning at least. Oh, so solo lane. I can't believe Severock didn't get nerfed. They showed the patch notes, the ones with um, Boris in it. Which, I'll make a video about him tomorrow. He looks crazy, by the way. Three knockups. But, um... I can't believe tanks, none of the tanks got nerfed. Huge. Thanks, Flurry. And I actually needed help clearing this wave because I want to shove it out. So it's good that Kalari stayed attacks. I, I think I'll level Q first. I probably should have just pushed Q for the free damage there. I don't know why he's still here. Okay. This Bellica can't hit a thing on me.
just kind of forcing them to swap places. <laughs> Pulled them to me and then uh, dashed away. Okay. Richter's blink is out and he his duo lane is just getting murdered without him. Now that I'm six, I should be able to squeak a kill out on somebody here. I don't know where the Richter went, unfortunately. Maybe I should have pulled there, but I didn't want to take a bunch of damage from the drone. This guy again. I don't know what his hook cooldown is at that level. I would have tried to dodge it, but I thought it wasn't up. It's looking to be a pretty good game. Like, I think Witch's Shoes is a good item for every mage, but I kind of don't want to build it if I can avoid it. I don't know why they... So, like, when they nerfed Spirit's Fang, uh, like, a patch or two ago, they said that it was because it was a keystone of every warrior's build. Uh, but isn't Witch's Shoes a keystone of every mage build? And I really don't think Spirit's Fang was that much stronger than Witch's Shoes. But, I don't know. Maybe it's because there's like literally no other mage item to build. If they nerfed witches, I don't know what mages would do. I'm just dead to the Aurora. <laughs> I didn't even get hit by that. That's a shame for her. I, I, it's a fiesta in my lane. I don't know why everybody's here all the time. I should be fine. I guess not. The structure is actually pretty good. I don't know how he fed. Maybe it's just because of his duo laner, but still. As long as duo lane wins, I really don't care if he camps my lane. I don't think this Bellica that's missed 70% of her uh, bombs is going to carry the game for them. Uh, I'll probably go... I, I, I'm either going to go Cultus or, like, Toto. Maybe Elkama. I kind of like just building big numbers on uh, this character. Sort of like a Countess build, because she's more of an assassin these days. Super close to killing her. I should have just pushed pain. I don't know why that didn't reach, by the way. That was... That should have hit. I was, like, right on top of her. I think the tower probably blocked it somehow. I don't know. It probably wouldn't have killed. I shouldn't have done it. I 
I'm just trying to get some kills. I want to get fed this game. Aurora has rotated so many times and has got nothing off of it. So our Sephirog is just power farming in solo lane. If our ADC fails, like we, we still have him to carry. Everybody in this game is, has won their lane. I could probably go right lane and just farm, but... That's rough. They're just playing around this tower. It's their last line of defense. I don't think she has ult up, so I should be fine to play this a little bit. Maybe I'll just go duo lane and try to 1v1 somebody. Because for whatever reason, they're all still uh, mid lane. I could always go so. I don't think Adele can really beat me. All she built was health, and now she's building physical. So as long as I space her out correctly, I should be fine. If she decides to come stop me, I should. I don't think I can, like, blow up to him blast yet, especially since he has this. But I think I can cycle through my abilities before he can kill me. A fanatic scissor doesn't really scare me. That's more of a survivable survivability item than it is a damage item. Yeah, they're all still mid. I'm just gonna kind of stay here. You know what? Maybe we can sneak up behind. The enemy rules the battlefield. Enemy I can get a kill on somebody. I just don't know who I want to get a kill on. Did I get it? Double. We'll take it. Uh, Cultist Blow will help there too. 15% more damage on low health targets. And then we might go... Might be time for a Toto. Don't want to wait too long to build it, because then you kind of give up a power spike. Like, there's no reason to spike super late when you can spike in the mid-game. And then I do like building a Kindus trick on pretty much every mage. It gives a ton of mana, and I like the ability power it gives. It's usually uh, more than any other item that you'll get. The allied tower is under attack. guy is just camping mid. I can't really do anything here. It's kind of ridiculous. With everybody duo, they can at least push over there. Okay, Richter finally left. Did she build the auto attack item? Oh, she built ADC. Ouch. Ready to go. 
I can get a kill if she steps up. Blown up. <laughs> she just missed. Oh, cool. She got it. I was going to blink in once my link was up, but I don't need to anymore. <laughs> I probably don't need to walk that close. Like, I didn't need the double damage there. It's just funny to do it. You do get double damage, right? I'm under the impression that since it comes out of both you and the person you're linked to, if you're standing next to them, you'll hit them twice. I don't know if that's actually true, though. Oh, I'm dead, Jimmy. Worth though, it's always worth if you get a kill. I need a break. Well, we have every spirit so far. I don't have we gotten an underling this game? I, don't, I think jungler's kind of just been ignoring underlings, but. We should be able to win the team fight to get Prime Guardian, and then it'll just be GG from there. I'm gonna go take this tower. It's like free 300, 350 gold. And I'm pretty sure I beat this lady. Nice twin blast here. I don't have ult, unfortunately. I could just blow up the twin blast. Nice. That terrible ult by Adele, too. <laughs> That's a lot of damage. I don't know, she was probably trying to ult the Severog or something. Uh, phases scalings aren't even that great, honestly. 50% and 70% are just not good compared to the other mages. Maybe it's because it hits twice. That's probably it, it, it actually. Because technically, if you do it twice, then it's double damage, but... What in the world is this guy doing? I forgot. I forgot he had fanatics. Ah, she's after me. She actually got it. Really? This wraith just gave... <laughs> This race just bamboozled us on rug. They both jumped down and she just teleported right back. That's kind of funny. Adele trying to make the 
Pentakill happened. We'll probably go the big boy at him. They do have an Aurora and a Severog and an Adele, so we'll probably get a lot of value out of it. And then we'll go, I don't know. We'll probably finish the Akendas just because it gives us a lot. And then we'll see from there. I mean, I probably didn't need to ult, but we'll take it. As long as I get the kill for it. I don't want to fight the Richter. Oops. I didn't link there. I'm just gonna kind of blind here. Try to make people survive. Ouch. I'm gonna try to root, that way Wraith can get away. Oh, never mind. Wraith can handle himself, I guess. Not bad. But we're kind of being ignored in these team fights. Like, I feel like it's really hard to play phase if they're actually focusing you. Because, like, if you want to play an up-close magic character, play Moragesh or Countess. We just about killed her. Unfortunately, backup arrived. That's crazy. She winks for it every time. She really does not like me. At our Kalari is uh, trying her best. Realistically, I think I just need more cooldown reduction. We get 10% off of bells, but like nothing else. I don't think Akindas gives it any either. It does not. Lair's ID could be good, especially combined with this. You heart, I might also build. I love the 15%. Even you know, if it's only while you have a shield up. I just love seeing my magic power increase. An ally has slain an enemy. Okay, Bellica. Not bad. Oh boy, I did not know they were on that. Luckily we have towers up still, so it's not that big of a deal. Who was on it though? Like, who's their jungler? I guess Aurora and <laughs> Richter just tanked it the whole time. Good for them, I guess. Yeah, I don't know if you're supposed to level Link all the way first. I, I, you use E a lot, so maybe I should have done that first, but it's already done. Her wave clear isn't half bad once you have some magic damage, though. My team is just fighting all day in mid lane. Like, I may as well stay here for the next wave or two. Okay. I don't do a whole lot of inhibitor damage, so we'll rotate behind and see what we can't kill. I did that wrong. 
Yeah, I messed up. Uh, the link didn't come out, so Twin Blast didn't die. Richter still would have blown me up. But I at least would have gotten the kill. Is Mini Moda any good on this person? I kind of feel like it would be. <laughs> we might try this. Oh boy. I think they're only winning these fights because they have the Prime Guardian buff. As soon as it wears off, we should go back to kind of crushing them. Plus, our Yin is kind of beating. Yeah, easy peasy. They were they were grouped up. Boy, a triple. I gotta wait to use Q for my link. Should be a quadra. Didn't I kill the last one too? I don't know if that's a quadra or a, a penta. I swear I killed. Killed these three. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe I'm just crazy. I don't know why the announcer never says it though. Like he didn't even say Quadra there. Oh, I just messed up. Ooh, that's rough. Thank goodness he missed, I would have died. He's, he's still gonna get the kill, unless he goes for Wraith. I'm fine. I had a shutdown, I don't know why he didn't go for me. What are you still doing here? I think it's quicker just to run back. Okie dokie. Mm. I don't know if I'm going to actually finish this this game. Actually, it does increase our power by quite a bit, but I, I want to try Mini Moda. Oh. Yeah. Like, in theory, it would be good, because you're, like, always hitting them with constant damage, and then you will keep them in that constant damage, too. Richter's dead. Take it down a notch. Not quite. I want their blue camp though. And one jungle camp should get us to level 16 as well. So right now our ult does 775 damage. And when it's level 3, we will see. So 777 because I leveled up. Oh, that's not that bad. About a 100 or so. Or less than 100 actually. But whatever. 
Again, I'm pretty sure the ult hits twice too, so it's doing like 1600 damage. Plus the Q, which is doing another thousand. They're all over there. Like, you kind of have to play smart like an assassin. You can't just go in and team fight people. Alright, suit again. The enemy core is under attack. Where's the twin and stuff? Oh, that's awkward. The enemy core is under attack. No, wait. I should have pained her. It would have killed. I'm I'm having a mental breakdown right now. I don't know what's happening. Okay, that's free. D don't we have a team? Where are they at? There they are. Wraith still hasn't gotten the memo, but I guess we don't need him. Plus, I'm sure Sephiroth probably has like 5,000 health at this point. I, he could probably 1v1 it. <laughs> It'd take forever, but... We, j we just need Kalari to smite it. Ouch. She just died. They got the Prime Guardian, but we team wiped them. That was a lot of damage on the Aurora. I did not expect her to blow up like that. Uh-oh. Good job. Yeah, that, that was a good hook by him. Hmm. I kind of want to see how much this increases our magical power. And see if it'd be more to the part. But we'll see. Because I'll need to have enough gold to buy both. So I'll need like 3,000 gold before I can buy my next item. That was risky. It was. It would have been great if it worked, but that inhibitor is full health. Their Bellica has a better ADC than ours is. How does she have 20 kills, by the way? When did that even happen? I guess I'll start blowing her up, because she's apparently the problem for our team. I really thought she was doing terrible. I had no idea she was this bad. Oh, uh, yeah, we can get another spirit. Okay, I can murder her myself at this point. Oh, my link isn't up. That's why it's not working. We probably should have waited for Sephiroth here. My bad. Locked on. Again, I want to see. So I don't want to buy a Kindas yet, because I want to, like, I would purchase it to see how much I have. It would give me 743. But if this gives me more, then I want to buy this. by an enemy. 
What? Yeah. I think Sephiroth should be able to live until I get there. And then we can maybe... My blink is up in 10 seconds, too, so I can just go kill them. What time do you need to ride back? Uh, probably like... Okay. At this point, our E just melts the Swim Blast. Oh, boy. We should be fine. I don't think this. she has the damage to kill us. Link is up in five seconds. Okay. And there we go. Is what? Uh, you said, is that her ult? Yeah. No, that's her E. Yeah. And then it'll root him if you hit him long right enough. Uh, her whole thing is her right click links you and an enemy. And then your Q and your ult are just shockwaves that come out of you and your linked target. Yeah. So if you're standing next to them, it hits them twice. Is up. This gives uh, 876... That is 811. It's not working, no. Because I have the green screen thing on, so the color's all messed up. Oh. <laughs> and then I'm gonna buy a purple potion here. Is respawning soon. And that was my little brother. He doesn't play a whole lot of this game, but when he does, he only plays Steel. And he's also a half-decent Drongo. I tried to make him play ADC one time. I don't want to mess around with the Richter. I'll walk around them. Come back here. I don't really want to link him though, is the thing. Like I'd rather save it for Adele. I'll paint her. Huge. As long as Severoc tanks for me, we just win this every single team fight. Yes. And that's a surrender. That was kind of a great game. I don't know how good FaZe is still, but she's pretty much an assassin, so play her in quick match and you'll probably get fed. Anyway, uh, GG, and I will see everybody in the next video. Hopefully a Boris video, assuming I can play him tomorrow.